Although the International Day of Girl Child is marked October 11th, due to ENTA's protests which partially restricted movements in some parts of Lagos, the day is yet celebrated on December 3rd. According to the organizer, the essence of the day is so significant it cannot be overlooked. What it's all about is we want an opportunity to reach out to young girls, an opportunity to, you know, empower them, inspire them, encourage them, give them some good knowledge, cause them to aspire even for the future. The event was organized in collaboration with the Lagos Island East local government, which stated that it has taken several steps towards empowering the female children in its area. We encourage the girl child to educate ourselves by providing the enabling environment in primary schools and um, high schools. We provide um, school materials. We, we, there is this ongoing now, um, GC for, for indigent students. So most of the thing is, if you don't train them, you can't blame them. Equal opportunity is stressed as a must for all, regardless of the gender. Participants of the event learned that they had the power to do anything. We need to keep empowering the girls because there is a level of neglect in the past as to what girls can do. It is my position. So we need to keep doing the kind of thing we are doing because it's very, very relevant and at the same time be talking to the boys. But both cannot be, you can't change, you can't change one for the other. We cannot neglect boys and talk to girls, and we cannot neglect boys and talk to girls. The message that girls need to hear, they need to continue to hear consistently. The message that boys need to hear, they need to continue to hear consistently, so that we can build a society that promotes equality. Girls should be empowered to do what they want. Our voice should be heard, that we are not babies. We should be treated equally. We have power to do anything. Gender equality is one of the sustainable development goals, and this kind of advocacy is needed at this time. Reporting for Plus TV Africa, Adebanke Udunui.